What's going on for That's right. A lot of stuff happening here tonight. 75 people in bracket, our second largest tournament. So, uh, if you have not come out to Smash the State and you were in the Raleigh area, you definitely should. No! Fix the camera! Hey, fix the camera! Well, with this tilted angle, it's it's amazing. Look at this tilted angle, guys. I'm tilted. Oh, okay, he's fixing it. Good job, Paul. In theory, he's fixing it anyways. In theory, there we go. There we go. It's fixed. His his tag is upset. What is SG58 upset about? Or is he or is he hoping that he'll cause an upset? Maybe maybe that's what it is. Oh, I, I guess we're not going to town after all. Never mind. It was all just a big joke. It was all just a joke. All right. Oh, I see. Wait, I think it, I think it's supposed to be a joke on the uh, Eden Saul is effing pissed meme. Um, so I think it's Eden Saul's upset. I don't know enough about that meme. That's just a state thing. Gotcha. That's it. I like I like the way the rule set is laid out. Hmm? All right, now we're getting into it. I think. All right, cool. I mean, he he won. So the call is for Smashville, I believe. It always weirds me out how the platform like comes into the center. No, oh, this is Hazards on Smashville. Never mind. Well, it's just gonna keep on moving. But it does that on Hazards off too. Like the platform. Just kind of rolls in. Yeah. It's weird. Why is it only one other tournament this month listed on the Facebook page? Uh, it's because we have spring break coming up, so we're going to have uh, like a week or two delay. Um, I'm not sure how long it is to the next one, actually. But yeah, spring break. We are a college, so we have to respect that. Spring break would be the perfect time to play, though, honestly. If we could, yeah, really. If we could use the facilities. If we could get into the building. Yeah. <laughs> So, uh, Theoretically, anyways, I mean, between people. SG58 off to a great start so far, which is honestly not the way I expected this. Um, Kai and Dylan? Kai and, Kai and Mikudra. That's what they want next. I believe SG58 has actually changed his up B. I don't think he used the old up B for uh, me gunner here. Oh, that was such a sick what? forward air to get him the momentum that he needed to be behind Zivor and use that F smash. That was a crazy, that was crazy so job right there. What? Just what? <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. That was that was a big brain play. That, that was a big was brain play. Galaxy brain. That was galaxy brain uh, everything, man. That's a surprisingly good recovery, actually. Yeah, it is. I, I think the gunner did benefit a lot from the the buffs in the. Oh yeah, you got a ton overage, of buffs. But I didn't think that it was that good. Still, it seems like I am very wrong in this assessment. He's, he's got some stuff now. The memes are done being memes. So. I mean, like I knew Swordfighter was good. I've tried playing that. Oh yeah. Um, that's cause, that's because Rex is Swordfighter. I, I <laughs> don't play Xenoblade. So oh man! I've made one for Xenoblade fans, but that's not. So this is so sad. Can I have a Douglas J sickle. Me. <laughs> that's just how cool I am. Oh, the barrage of projectiles, looking like a Belmont out here. Fuck. Fuck. Meanwhile, Zevor is trying to find himself in with that nice little sword. Oh, he's gonna dash back that F smash. That's the Zevor classic right there. Yep. He can't play his. Uh, he cannot play his standard waiting game that yeah. I, I, I hear Zephyr is known for. Definitely, Zephyr known as uh, one of the more defensive players. Uh, he is not afraid to play lame when he needs to, to yeah. make sure that he turns stuff around. He has done just that. Uh, he has definitely adapted to this match to make sure that he has gotten back in it. But it's really hard to play lame against a uh, projectile character. Yeah, it's true. Eventually, you do have to go in. Yep. And he does have the lead right now, so maybe he's hoping like oh, I can make yeah, him approach. On how this ends. Oh my gosh! Wow. Not to say that could change very quickly. That is like, I remember um, you get hit with like a fully charged shard shot from Me Gunner in like Smash Four, and like it wouldn't kill you to like 150 or something. It's crazy. Like it was actually just an awful move. <laughs> like just play Samus because you might as well. Basically. Uh, but uh, Me Gunner actually has kill power in this game, which is nice. You know, well deserved. Excellent. Uh, honestly, if your move is just going to be exactly like Samus's, it should probably have the same or at least similar kill power to Samus's. 
we're definitely happy to at least have kill power be balanced in this game overall in general. So. Uh oh my god, he's going deep! Oh wow! Woo. And Mikano can actually angle that recovery too? Oh yeah, he can do a lot of stuff That's with that. That's crazy. If I'm not mistaken, I'm not sure if it's this up B or one of the other up Bs that Mikano has, but I believe either this one or the other one spikes when you use it on startup against the opponent. Wow. Like, I think yeah, if he was underneath, up. like, that rocket thing. Oh, that's oh, going to be the yeah. smash, and that's going to end it. I mean, he was in a really tough position, being in the disadvantaged state uh, up above Lucina. Yeah, he's I don't think such he a, a fast great character. landing option right there. Yeah. He doesn't have the bombs of Samus to try and, like, mix up his direction as much. I mean, that's probably the one thing that... Sivor adapting like now usual, doing a very good job. To the weird matchup he's not used to. <laughs> Going to Hazards Off, might be Stadium. It will be Stadium, actually. Oh, come on, Hazards on Stadium. <laughs> hazards on Stadium. Let's, let's, let's go back to Melee. That'd be godlike. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see some infinites happen down the little pit. Yeah, really. <laughs> Uh, so here Truly we are. Truly competitive gameplay. Truly competitive gameplay. Yeah, everybody loves Melee Stadium, man. All right, so let's see what SG58 can do to, to mix things up. Like he's having difficulty in the beginning here. Already throwing out the F smashes for both of these players, actually. Like, and that's at least like four F smashes I've already seen. Yeah. The match just started like 20 seconds ago. Calm down, guys. You're still low percent. The heat coming off of these players. Oh, that's not, as bad as it says, me gonna have a combo throw? That's not get carried away. I mean, we gave the me some good stuff. We can't give the me his combo throws. I mean, Samus has combo throws. Why not give the me gunner combo throws, right? <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true. It's just diet Samus at the end of the day. <laughs> Actually, probably better than Samus in this game, I don't honestly. Know. I don't. I don't know who's better. I don't know. It's no not. Clue. That's a great back air, though. That is a great back air. Surprisingly powerful. And I think it's, it's definitely wow. Oh, the grenade! That I think it's a mine. Mine, that, mine, grenade. I don't question know. Question mark. Ellipsis is great F smash. Yeah, though. great dash back into the F smash. Just doing a great job reading the ledge options and finishing off that stock. That's a ton of range. Oh my God! Oh, that was shield break. That was very close Woo. to being one for sure. Ready, I'm used to seeing that shield break because like in Smash 4 people would play with like equipment on and stuff. No, oh and God. so like they'd have like the max attack me gunners or whatever, yeah. and just like crap would shield break at ridiculous. <laughs> like a, it'd be like a fully done shield, like do like a uncharged F smash and just break shield. Interesting option reading backwards. I wonder if that was a button in the same foot. Oh, I don't think that roll was intentional either from uh, SG58. Definitely looked like you... Uh oh What's he doing yeah. out there? You gotta try and find some extra credit on this stock. Yeah. And he's having a really hard time. But he's at least not dying, living to some insane percentage right now. Zebor's just not leaving any openings for him. Yeah, but at the same uh, time... Okay. Uh, just not, not even that was gonna be punished. Wow. I feel like SG58's just uh, me playing a little bit too erratically. Oh, there we go. Okay, he does not What? And that drags down into stuff? Okay. There you go. All right. This character's all right. Up throw. Okay, yeah, he's a, two, he's a 206. He's a 206. At least that she uh, managed to find some um, for a second, percent. I, for a second, I thought we were looking at, like, melee morph or something where, like, the up throw isn't killed to, like, 210 on some of the heavy <laughs> characters. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Thankfully, that is not the case. Yeah. For Zephyr's sake, anyways. Yeah, Zephyr's like, uh, I'll take my kill throw I have right now, thank you very much. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, you can hit that mine back. That's pretty crazy, actually. Wild, dog. <laughs> so, uh, Zephyr doing another good job of adapting and kind of bringing this back. Not in the lead yet, but... Oh, that was a great trap! Wow. Nice charge shot coming out from SG58. We Eating might be with no options. We might be on our way to a game three situation here. Ooh! Nice tech. Zevor certainly doesn't want a game three though. He just wants to close this out right now. Yeah, he does. Don't want to give this me gunner any momentum. Yeah, I think I think SG58 needs to watch out for these rolls in the ledge. He did it again, and Zevor's catching on. Yep. That's a dangerous option too. It's very, very punishable compared to everything else. Oh yeah, and that time he's gonna get the he's get the gonna nair. jump. He got the nair. Hit with the nair. It's 
all it takes. And this is all evened up now. Zevor has done a fantastic job of bringing it back. I think it would be tragic if this didn't go to game three because SJ58 has been playing so well. He has. But it looks like Zephyr is again onto his steam. Yeah, he's not <laughs> letting him touch the ground. He's steamrolling him right now. This is exactly how the last turn game ended for them. And she 58 just throwing out some pretty desperate looking options right now. Oh my goodness, every time. How's he going to get back down, folks? As she goes into the air, it's, it's a moment of, of and, panic. And, and really, he just needs to get to center stage because if he's on the ledge, you know Zephyr is going to look for that F smash. He's gonna throw it out, and he's right. he's gonna kill him. Okay. Okay. Managed okay. To catch that read with an up with an up tilt. That's good. Got something going. All right. He's got he's got mid stage. He's got a little bit of momentum going. Uh -oh. I don't know. I don't know, Chief. Now we're in a dangerous mid -stage. position. Oh, oh my, my god. That was oh, okay. Man. Okay. Woo. That ledge movement was kind of. Zephyr it's kind of crazy, man. Cancel out the mo that momentum with a little bit of his own forward smash. Zephyr going to take it 2-0, though, after a pretty good lead for Zephyr 58. just wasn't enough. 